Hey guys, thank you for watching. This clip was from our show today, our live show that can be seen exclusively on odds.com. Just hit the link below. But most importantly, you paid in full today. All right, let's move on to the Monday Nighter Patriots Jets. And had I known that Darno would not be in the lineup, I wouldn't be sitting here with the Jets. And I'm very upset. It's going to hurt me badly. Uh, Bigly. I'm in trouble. I'm in big trouble. Thank God I have the under. So that's going to help. And maybe Darno, wow. Yeah, no, this is at 10. Sorry, yeah. Uh, there are some nine and a halfs now, which makes me feel a little better. This total opened up at 41, but we got it at 42 and a half, Bebsy. Uh, I guess – if Flacco is going to be in a quarterback that the Jets team told under is just cash and cash and cash. So I think I should make a move on the Jets team total under. Uh, let's see how low it is right now before I make a move on it. Pepsi, what's your feeling on the Monday nighter at this point? Uh, well, yeah, I mean, you kind of said everything I want to say about it. The fact that Sam Darnold isn't playing, that's going to hurt them. That really, I mean, that, that does really hurt your play. But I still love this under. This under just screaming, uh, hit it, hit it hard. I cannot see either one of these teams putting up a ton of points. Yeah. Ugh. Joe Flacco is going to be there. So I trust the Patriots defense. 14 and a half is too high. I think I should jump on this Jets team total under. What do you think, Bebsy? Yeah, I like the play. I, I, I like it balancing that out, especially with I, I would, you know, certainly have comf more comfort in that play than uh, than you take in the Jets and the points with Darnold being out. But uh, this is a, that's a nice little balance out play for you there, Jimmy. And that is what I'm doing. I'm adding the Jets team total under 14 and a half, which does put us in a situation where we have both added plays on the afternoon and Monday action. It's 62 Fahrenheit clear, three miles per hour in New York tomorrow evening. Pat's coming off their fourth straight loss. Cam Newton looks bad. And they've been without Edelman and Nikhil Harry. They need those guys badly what is your feeling of cam newton's ineptitude do you think that he can change things around i don't know he really you know he looked very good the first couple weeks i almost wonder if that shoulder is bothering him again because you see his mechanics seem to be different again like he's seems to be laboring to throw so yeah i i don't know if it's gonna turn around i, I know for sure we'll never see mvp cam again uh, at least at the start of the year, he was getting it done. I don't know if he turns it around. Belichick seems very bullish on Cam. Um, quieted a little bit lately with heaping praise on him. But, yeah, I, I have next to no faith in him right now. It's too bad because I really loved watching MVP Cam. He was so much fun. And now he's just not that guy anymore. Now he's, you know, broken Cam and pouting Cam. And, and those are the Cams I don't like to see. Yeah, he's struggling. And I don't, you know, without Edelman and Nikhil Harry, what do you expect? I mean, he's just going to struggle. Is, is Nikhil Harry, like, is he a factor yet? Do we have, like, can we, he hasn't done anything. He's done absolutely nothing. I think we can agree that Nikhil Harry's a bust at this point. Huh. Yeah. And Edelman is, in real trouble. So yeah, I mean, it's just a lot of a lot of this is is you know Edelman thrives so much on those timing routes and that connection. It's it's just not there. It's not there with Cam. There's just the jar or the cupboard is empty. There's no talent on this Pats team. You know, for everyone trashing Belichick this year and being like, oh, well, see, look, he's nothing without Brady. He didn't have anybody. There's nobody on this team. There's nobody healthy. There's half the team quit 
due to COVID. Like, there's just – he's got nothing. And he's, he's doing the best he can with nothing. But they're – you know, they had cap issues. There's, there's all kinds of reasons why this team is struggling. Yeah, their cap issues have been – Horrible, very, very tight rope that they're walking here. Uh, Edelman might be done for the season. Uh, he's on injured reserve now with the knee injury. Uh, Nikhil Harry probably is not going to be in the lineup either. Brady says, do the Pats want to turn it around at this point? There's some good quarterbacks in this upcoming draft. This Pats team is that bad. Uh, Brady says, Gilmore wants in. Edelman not playing. Wrote down the rosters. And who is better in this game? Seriously, your Jets play is live. So, Brady. Huh. There you have it. I added Jets team total under 14 and a half. We're already in this full game under 42 and a half. And then I'm on the Jets plus seven. Something I was pretty confident in before I realized I was going to have Flacco. Uh, 